I know my Republican friends claim we're not producing enough oil, and I'm limiting oil production. Quite frankly, that's nonsense. President Joe Biden calls out Republicans after asking Congress to suspend the federal gas tax holiday through the end of September. Drivers are hoping for a break this summer from high gas prices. Though the tax holiday offer seems good on paper, it may ultimately end up making things worse, according to at least one expert. CBS 4's Joel Waldman breaks down what those savings would mean to drivers. It's too high. Too high. Yes, yeah, too much. Easier said than done. With the economy already on a rocky road, drivers find themselves just trying to hang on when it comes to paying for gas. Painful, man. Especially having a premium car, like you have to put the gas is crazy. Almost six dollars already on gas. Putting in forty dollars is really like putting in tens. President Biden is now hoping to help those feeling financial pressure at the pump. By suspending the 18 cent gas tax, federal gas tax for the next 90 days, we can bring down the price of gas and give families just a little bit of relief. What would this mean for you? Gas Buddy calculated, and with no federal tax on average per week, it would cost roughly $5.52 less to fill up your pickup truck, $3.68 less for your minivan, $2.94 for your full-size car, and $2.21 less for a compact car, which could add up over time. But Gas Buddies Patrick DeHaan also says the tax holiday could backfire. Providing lower prices, whether it's through a tax cut or some other uh, outside factor, uh, it's likely going to spur more gasoline consumption at a time that demand is high and supply is rather low. So it could exacerbate the problem that has led prices to these high levels. The president's plan is also expected to face opposition in Congress, where even Democratic lawmakers are divided and many Republicans already have their minds made up. I'm willing to embrace his proposals for a gas tax holiday. It's yet another gimmick, uh, another Band-Aid, and something they know is dead on arrival up here in Congress. The president is also asking states to enact their own tax holiday because state tax is generally higher than federal tax, and therefore you'll be saving even more money. Reporting in Doral, Joe Waldman, CBS 4 News Tonight.